Welcome to the WeWork co-working space at West 57th Street, located at 142 West 57th Street in Midtown West New York City. You can visit this WeWork co-working space via mass transit using the 57th Street subway station or alternatively the 7th Avenue subway station. Reserve your desk or office suite via WeWork.com WeWork, it's where businesses thrive. Use Moonymeter.com to better understand the neighborhoods surrounding each New York City we work co-working space co-working space or kind of push that force field out when I feel comfortable that everything is safe and I'm minimizing all the risk um, if you know what you're doing and you go slow and you build from the core and constantly build and build and attack and build and attack the core you're gonna be very successful you're gonna save a lot of money and you, you know, ultimately you will become what you want to be um, and your nucleus will grow. But even however small your nucleus is, um, it's going to be very, very high quality and powerful. So at the end of the day, you know, quantity definitely matters. Let's not forget that. But it's all about the quality. It's all about the quality. And the quality in, you know, the way in which I lead my life and the way I carry myself, I'm really proud of that. The quality is there. And I think that's what I'm trying to say is that the quality is there. And people recognize the hard work. And you know what? Everything is coming to maturity. Everything is coming to fruition. The market is taking care of what needs to be taken care of. And everything is falling into place. The secret to social media and just marketing and building businesses in general is number one, you have to you know have the drive and the motivation, right? You know, before you build a product, you have to have some type of desire to do something. Whether that desire comes from you know a good experience or maybe someone did something bad to you and you want to prove others wrong, whatever that reason, you have to have the desire and the motivation. Then, once you've kind of figured out what you want to do, phase two is building the product. You have to build whatever it is you're going to sell or whatever it is that people are going to use, which is what you're selling. And then while you're building that product, it's going to be difficult, especially if you're trying to do something very, very high quality. That's going to take a lot of blood, sweat, and tears. Um, let's say that takes one year. So that's one year of your life. You're going to have to be very disciplined and very determined and not taking no for an answer. And then number three is you have to, you know, the next phase is you have to go out into the world and you have to sell that product. And the secret to social media, the secret to you know, what I learned from the Winklevoss twins and, and uh, you know, in the early days of Facebook and Connect You, it's not something that they taught me. It's just something that we all did was, you know, just like I, I said before, get your friends to join the site. Then tell them to tell their friends. Then tell your other friends. Once you get everyone you know on the site, then, then you get their second-degree connections and your second-degree connections. And 
Start with the core, start with the nucleus, start with your parents, start with your high school buddies. Keep everything as individual as possible. In this day and age when technology is at the forefront, it, you know, it always has been, and it's, you know, it's so easy to send out emails and you know, do everything electronically, the best sales is done person to person and you know you can sell 50 e- you can send 50 emails in in 1 minute or 1000 emails in 30 seconds um, but having that 1 hour one on one contact with one person you you know i feel like that goes a longer way and you feel better about your company and what you've accomplished if you've gotten that one key individual after 1 hour of coffee or lunch than opposed to sending out you know, 1,000 emails in, in 20 seconds. At the end of the day, what remains true today is what remained true 10 years ago, 100 years ago, 1,000 years ago, and 10,000 and 1 million years ago. It is that people recognize and reward hard work. 